<laughs> okay, guys. So, uh, I, I would. I don't care if you're a Herford enthusiast or not. If you're a livestock enthusiast, you need to look in here. Um, standing room only. Uh, come from the Leach family there in southern Indiana, and and uh, you, you know. Uh, Quite honestly, uh, he was off to my right over here. I don't know where he's at now. Uh, but, uh, oh, he's in the back back here. Uh, he drops this boar out. Jeremy drops the boar out. Uh, I'd actually, uh, Lindsay and I was, was probably within 10 miles of that, judging a hog show, 20 miles. And um, anyhow, I drove back down there and looked at this guy. And he's a guardrail back on Rub It In and, and if you look on page 63, you can see, uh, I think, uh, Mama's a litter mate to the Champion Guild at Indiana last year. Grandma uh, was, um, uh, I believe, the Champion Guild, the exposition. Great Grandma uh, was the uh, Champion Guild at the Junior Nationals. And, and we're just, uh, I mean, that, that Sal family is impeccable. But I'm going to tell you what, I mean, we're talking a Hereford boar with a crossbred hip and hind leg, a Hereford boar with crossbred bone. I mean, this guy's just simple depth of body, stoutness of feature, study his chest coming at you. I mean, this this is one, one Lindsay kind of talked about what she done with hardwood last year. Guys, we, uh, we've got, uh, uh, we got the Bona Vista boar, and we've got the Leech, Hers uh, the Leech Herford boar, uh, two new young guys. I think they complement each other. They're different boars on other ends of the spectrum. But guys, there's two unique individuals made for a lot, a lot of Herford females. We're grateful we're not on the Herford uh, Grand Nationals and the Tam Grand Nationals anymore. And, Hopefully those the Herford uh, enthusiasts can look in here. This is one that needs to be used a lot. So uh, we want to thank the Leach family for allowing us to have this guy. And um, uh, just a great individual.